Hey, welcome back to Yup and Psycho, guys. We're back here again, and hopefully we can do a little better this time. You came to see me, Tiki Taka? I apologize for all this mess. How embarrassing. Dot, 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 indeed, Brian. Alright. Fingers crossed here. That we don't die immediately. Last time we were here, we were not having a good time, I'll say that much. Alright, use this as a sort of safe haven. Are you kidding me? Not gonna lie, I'm a little bit angry about that hitting me, but that's alright. I guess that just lasts forever too, huh? Alright, pull these wires out. Boom, baby. What a relief. You know, I know you from the cameras, of course, since you arrived. And now you're here. Maybe you think it's a silly question, but have you come to save me, too? Yes. I don't think it's picking up the audio. Let me fix that for you guys real quick. Now it should be. Now we just have to wait for 20 minutes for this. Got it. Alright, wires. That's fine, though. Oh, really? That... Uh, what the fuck? I'm actually... I did... Okay, guys. Might have figured something out here. At least somewhat. We gotta block their path here somehow. How will this work? That, I'm not entirely sure. I think I'm gonna have to use both TVs. So like, this TV here... To block... No, I don't know if that'll work. But if I have an idea. Time it for when they land there. Although we don't really get a good foresight. Right, press this now. Never mind. I thought that might be able to stop it. Doesn't seem to be the case. Well, this is really terrible. Try that. Alright, we'll be back in a minute, I guess, and we'll see if we can figure something out. Okay, you guys are gonna have to bear with me here and watch this happen. I know what to do now. They don't have enough torque to move the TV, so we're gonna push our other TV up and force them up into the, if you can see my hand, into the buttons in the top right corner. <sighs> will this be easy? Absolutely not. This will be hell, but we will do it. So, we're going to need at least 27,000 cycles to do it, but we're going to get there. Oh, look at that! Not terrible. Push, push, push. Ah! That is the other thing, it has to line up right, too. Push, and we're dead. God almighty, this is awful. So now they're stuck, kind of. Is this a good spot for them to be stuck at? I guess, yeah. This is good, I think? I'll just be real with you, this is the worst puzzle I've ever done in any game. It just takes too long and it's not fun. I know your name. But don't worry, I'm not telling her. Okay, well that's good. I've really enjoyed watching you run around the building. I laughed a lot at the faces you make when you're scared, but I've also felt sad whenever you get hurt. 
Want to top me off and give me some HP back, please? You're so vulnerable. Oh my god, he's me. I'd like to lock you in a room full of cameras 24 hours a day. Oops, sorry, that sounded really weird. I was just saying that to protect you from her. The truth is that now, having you in front of me, I'm a little sad. I'm gonna miss how your story goes. I wanna ask you one last question before I go. This morning when you arrived at the company, I opened the elevator doors, but at no point did I say your name. Why did you get on? To take the opportunity, don't go back empty handed. Yeah, that was my, this was my dream job, the capital, the best company. Move up the categories. I didn't want to miss the opportunity. I see. You can do it, Brian. Kill her. Kill her. Kill her. Uh oh, central popping up. Oh. Big brother beat the security surveillance. Oh. They're showing up. Well, I think we're good to go. He's dead. He's got something in his hand. He's got a security camera. Nice. Don't know what to do with that, but we do got it. We're finally done with that terrible segment. Oh my god. Might be one of the worst things I've ever experienced in a video game, but it's okay. At least it's over. Is there anything in here that we care about? Ooh, a slice of bread. Okay, not bad. Some nothing. Are you ki I could have went back there the, this whole time. Seems that the security employees have been disabled. Oh my god, that's good. Oh, we could probably go talk to the snakehead girl now, right? The detective. Gotta say, I'm definitely hitting a save real quick. Alright, finally. I can hear her breathing. I don't believe she's this way. She's through this little cavernescent maze here. And then up to the left from here. Here. No, further still. Okay, there she is. I can actually see her little area here now. Left, left, uh, down, left, up. Hello. Hello? My name is Pasternak. It's nice to meet you. I'm Jung. What are you looking at? Do I have something on my face? No, I just find it weird to see, I mean, well, to see someone from HR right here. Yeah, well, it's because I'm investigating. Yeah, you know, like a detective. You can call me Sherlock Holmes. Bet you look suspicious. What's your name? I just told you, I'm Pasternak. Well, you're the prime suspect. What? What am I suspected of? I accuse you of blackmail, extortion, and coercion of HR employees. I didn't do anything. <laughs> Take it easy, I was just practicing. We already know the identity of the offender, he's an employee on the fourth floor. Huh. We know who's behind the crime, we've already reported it to the union, but we need something else, something important. Evidence? Elementary. So I've come all this way to record a confession from that impertinent man without him noticing. And just now I was about to get that evidence to solve this whole case, but you interrupted me. Want me to give you a hand and see if I can get that? <coughs> Thank you, but I don't need the help of a rookie. Here. Oh, never mind. How about this? I got a blank VHS tape. Oddly enough, you have your suspicious tape in your hands. What a coincidence. It's not suspicious, it's empty. There's nothing on it. I see, you're trying to throw me off with false evidence that leaves nowhere. Ah, okay, so if we go to the camera feeds, we can maybe... Well, the one guy was chatting it up. Uh, Platman, or Chapman, I should say. 
The interference on some of the cameras is gone. Yes, so now we should check them. A baby stroller. It's gone now. Okay, weird. So I guess we'll just look through some of the cameras. Come on, Doshi, are you ready? Take it easy, man. Fixing one of these things takes time. What's the rush? It's none of your business, okay? Fix it as soon as possible. Oh. <laughs> Nothing new there. Guess we gotta find a camera with something interesting going on in it. Oh, I wasn't- the recording was not paused that whole time. Oops. Oh, there's Hugo. Is he about to pee on a tree? What on earth? What was that? So he put something in there. Wait, and then it looks like the office is all trashed. That's not good. Check this last camera. I think we might already checked it, though. Yeah, there's the baby stroller in there. Okay. And what was this one again? This is just Doshi. Okay, we'll be back. Ah, uh, but before we can go through all these cabinets now that it's safe, we got a pizza, a candy bar, and maybe some more stuff if we're lucky here. A pencil. Pencil's good, man. Uh, I do like getting a pencil. I don't think there's anything else worthwhile here. Whew. Let me check this camera real quick. Oop. Right, this was that one. That's fine. Well, all things considered, it's time to go back to the office. I stand by my theory that this is one of the worst things I've ever done in my life. So bad. Well, you guys know it. It's fine, though. Let's see if we can give Doshi the camera. Nope. Alright. How many credits do I have right now? 105. Actually, I'm actually rolling. Alright, we're fine. For now. Okay, to the office, man. Goodness gracious. I think we're floor five, yeah? Alright, so immediately we're checking this freaking thingy. Oh, not here. The tree in the office, he put something in it. I think it's this one right here. What'd you put in here, Hugo? <gasps> Why can't I interact with it? There we go. Bloody key. Where could this key be from? I don't know. Oh, uh, wrong office. We're D? We're office D, right? Or no, office E. Okay. Oh, uh, look trashed up in here. I guess it isn't. Yeah, 
anything new in here. Doesn't look like it. Okay, this is where the baby carriage was, so maybe there's something over here we can look at. This seems up. Oh, you're in the office. So what are we supposed to do here? Huh. Yeah, I don't know. I'm a little bit confused, to be honest. We could check this trash can. Nope. All right, let's figure something out. She's back in here, man. I don't fucking. Oh, doesn't look like it. Here. Nope. I thought maybe because that was a portrait, I could put the family little photo in there. Looks like that's not the case. Oh my god, man. Where is she at? Or like, what am I supposed to do at this point? Like, it took me like, genuinely 45 minutes to beat that area. Spread across two different play times because it's just not, it just wasn't fun. And now I don't know what to do. I found a, I saw the surveillance for the bloody key. Got the bloody key. Don't know what the hell that does. Like. Is she back over here? No, she's not. I don't know. All right, that's going to do it for this episode. I think this is going to be the last episode of this that I'm going to do, sadly. Because I'm getting very tired of the premise of run around for 45 minutes, don't know what's happening, don't get any sort of inkling as to what to do. I watched multiple cameras. There's a baby thing on the, like, the third floor. But when I go there, there's nothing I can do to interact with it. So it's like, I think I'm just going to be done. So yeah, call this a premature finale. But yeah, that's it. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.